everyone and welcome to my channel. Make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you never miss a new video or a live stream and give me a big thumbs up at the end of the video. Hey you guys, it's your girl Chakisha from Her Lovely Plan and I am back with another planner related video. This is a planner set up in my A5 Traveler's Notebook and as most of you guys know, myself, along with E. Michelle, Shea Budgets, and Tarshell B, decided to challenge ourselves by using one physical planner for the month of March. And with that, we extended it out to all of you guys to jump onto this challenge. So I want to put a disclaimer out there before I go further. Just know when we say one planner challenge, that means to have one planner that you use for the whole month or at least to try. Now, if you have jobs that require you to have separate, um, a separate planner, that doesn't count. That's your job, that's your bread and butter, keep it separate. Um, for me, I am a content creator, so I will still be doing my planner related videos and filming how I set up my classic planner. Um, and as you know, I said, I'm gonna integrate my mini happy planner spreads back in here, but I won't be planning in them at all by no means am i going to be doing any after the pins it's just going to be decoration just so you guys can continue to see and be inspired how to set your spreads up because i do have a lot of planner newbies that want to figure out how to set up their planners so i'm going to still continue to create those videos but i'm only going to be planning this everything from my monthly my weekly my faith planning my pr team post planning Everything is going to be done in this one planner. I'm not going to be using my B6 in which I am ooh, cringing because I love my B6 as well as my A5, but I'm going to do everything in this one planner. So just to kind of show you a few things that I will be using in my weekly setup for the week of March the 4th through the 10th, I'll be using um, my Boss Lady Mini Kit from Maddie Posa Studios and I'm actually on her PR team. So I will have a link in the description box so you can get this kit along with some other amazing things um, from her shop and use my discount code. I'll also be kind of switching it up. Um, I'm not using Simply Gilded Washi today, but I will be using this bow washi that came with a trio set from Samantha May. Um, and then these are just some um, washies that I had you know that i've been hoarding forever and then i'll probably be pulling some other elements like um, overlay covers and icon stickers but this is primarily what i'll be using so let's see how my plans turned out from last week before we get started okay so this is my spread from last week and as you can see it was very functional as well as pretty um and Y'all know I'm in love with these overlay header covers. Um, and this kit was so pretty. The colors were so vibrant. It just, just made my eyes light up every time I looked at it. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you my March insert um, before we go ahead any further. Now I have been using printables from the Digital Dash. Um, and this is the March insert for actually the b6 because i don't have legal paper what i do is i just use the b6 insert and then i just increase my numbers so it can um, fit now what i did do because i said i am doing the one planner challenge i am tracking my budget so on the first week because in her kit she includes like literally the it was the what the 25th through the third and of course I like to start off my month new. So I covered it up with this graph paper and I just put some washi up here and printed it off what my monthly bills will be and my expenses. Um, and then down here as well, I'll track my income. And we're gonna go ahead and just look at this insert real quick. So like I said, I just taped this down to kind of put the pages together because I didn't need that week. Um, so this is what the insert looks like. Again, this is the actual B6 insert. The A5, these boxes are a lot wider. Um, and I just need to get legal paper because this paper is too short. Um, this is the regular letter size paper. Um, so once I get some legal paper, I'll probably more than likely um, use 
the regular A5 inserts that come with it. But just to let you know that if you all have B6 planner inserts and you don't want to buy any more, you can still use them in your larger traveler's notebooks. Just increase the sizes and it'll make sure it'll um, print for the size that you need. So we're going to go ahead and get started. And as you can see, I decided to staple this booklet this time. So I got some holes all over the place, but that's neither here nor there. Nor there. Enough talking. Let's get planning. All right, so I'm not going to do a lot of voiceover on this video because it's pl pretty self-explanatory um, on what I'm doing, you know, what stickers I'm laying, where I'm laying it. Um, but I do want to address... Um, about deco and functionality in your spread because I did have a question um, that I got from one of my subscribers about how do I write in my planner with so much deco so for me and I think I've said this before I pretty much know the days that I need to have a lot of white space the days that I don't I try to put as much decoration as I can and if I'm not sure, I'll try to leave enough space so I can add something in. And this month, I'm gonna really have to um, be challenged to do what I say because I am participating, as I stated, in the One Planner Challenge. So I have to make sure that in this weekly insert, I'm leaving enough room to document what I'm doing in my personal life, my YouTube schedule, my Instagram schedule, um, and anything like that in my weekly. I do have other inserts in this planner that are used for other functions, but in regards to tracking my day-to-day -day, um, personal life and things like that, I need to be very strategic. So to answer my subscriber's question, I did answer it in the comments, but I want to answer it publicly as well. It's about knowing your schedule. That's why pre-planning is important, especially if you are a decorative planner, because you want to make sure that you don't put too much deco on a day that you know that you have a lot to do. And what you'll see further in the video, like Wednesday, um, it's a free day for me. I don't have to work, so I will be doing a lot of things that I did not get done on Monday or Tuesday. Um, and I'll be leaving the space to roll over because I do roll things over because life happens and you don't always do everything within that 24 hours because out of those 24 hours, you do sleep. <laughs> but, you know, I try to be mindful and I try not to um, limit myself with white space. I don't like a lot of white space um, just because I don't, but I'm a smart planner in which I always can go back and add more stickers if I need to doing, um, you know, throughout the week. Um, so, you know, I'm excited about challenging myself. It's been a minute since I've had one planner that I put everything in. So this will be fun. Hopefully and prayerfully, I can stick to it.
all right you guys so as i stated i really didn't have to do a lot of voiceover because this plan with me is very self-explanatory and i do enough talking at the beginning and the end of my video to keep you informed so i hope you've enjoyed so far and i hope you keep watching until the end of the video Alright you guys, so I'm finished my spread in my A5 weeks for the week of March the 4th through the 10th. I'm really loving how this turned out. I can't wait to actually fill this up with my after the pin. And look how cute this pin matches. Like, really y'all. Uh, make sure y'all are subscribed to her newsletter because she will be posting um, her VB newsletter soon and y'all know those vb kits be fire y'all be seeing my videos don't be sleeping on the vb kits y'all <laughs> but nevertheless um this is my spread i'm loving this kit i'm loving the colors i'm loving that i was able to pull out some washi that i've had for a while to incorporate in this spread because like i said 2019 is the year of no more ordering sick of ordering stuff and not using it's pretty but if you don't use it it's gonna end up being non-usable or a waste of your money and i don't got time to be wasting my coins <laughs> so i hope y'all like this spread like i said i am determined that i am going to do everything possible to stay in this one planner and um, and i do plan on doing um, flip throughs because I have other inserts that I'll be using but not all of them I'll be decorating or filming I will be trying to um, film a wellness Wednesday so you can see my wellness insert as you know I started using one when I was in my standard traveler's notebook but since I've found my love and my spot in this travel's notebook community in an a5 and a b6 i decided to put my wellness um, insert which is from the 1407 planner company was well, not company but the planner 1407 planner i decided to get an a5 insert to add into my a5 so i can't wait until y'all see that spread because I'm really excited and I'm really tired of being fluffy. <laughs> Your girl needs to lose a few pounds. But anyway, this is it. This is it. And I mean, I'm excited about Saturday. Um, I'm doing my first official meetup um, for the 804 Planner Group. So if you see this video and you're in the Richmond, Virginia area or close, make sure you follow the 804 Planner Group so you can get more details about that meetup. As well, we'll be doing a virtual meetup um, hosted by E. Michelle at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. Um, so make sure you, I have a um, post on my IG um, page so you can get more information about that. It's gonna be a whole bunch of us planning together virtually which is going to be super fun it's going to be my first time doing it um so that's about it you guys let me know what you think about this spread give me a big thumbs up if you like the video if you give me a thumbs down i still love you too i be seeing them thumbs down in my videos <laughs> y'all just be inspiring me and pushing me to do more and go harder so keep on giving me them thumbs down okay i appreciate you <laughs> but yeah nevertheless um, if you have any suggestions, any comments, any questions, you know where to drop those as well. Make sure you scroll through that description box. I got a lot of discount codes for some shops that I'm PRing for, as well as just some referral codes that I get because I'm a part of a lot of rewards program. And I encourage you all to join these rewards programs because the more you spend, the more saving you get. And y'all know we spend a lot, so why not get a little bit of compensation? So if this spread has inspired you and if it has touched your planner so make sure you share this with your planner friends so they can also be inspired to create their own lovely plan so until next time planner fam peace
Thank you again for watching Her Lovely Plan and I hope that you click that subscribe button and that notification bell.